Eco is a prosthetic arm that can be fitted with Lego bricks so that the wearer can take designing their own hand into their own hands. Prosthetic limbs are made more or less in the image of the limb they are replacing but, as many are discovering, they don't necessarily have to be. And, as Carlos Arturo Torres formerly of the Umea Institute of Design in Sweden, now living in Chicago, Illinois, wants the world to know they can do a lot more than just look nifty and and flash LEDs. For his final project university in 2014, Torres designed Eco, a prosthetic arm for children that also acts as a platform for creative LEGO projects. The project was awarded the prize for open design student in the 2015 CORE 77 Design Awards earlier this month. The needs of a kid in disability are not always related to physical activity but often alternatively the social and psychological aspect sometimes a functional element is everything they need but some other times it might be a spaceship or a dollhouse or a telescope or a video game controller or a swim fin Torres explained on the project page on CORE 77 what if kids could use their imagination to create their own prosthetics their own tools according to their own needs learning creating being kids the arm was created in collaboration with Lego Future Lab, the toy company's research and development team, and Zarek, a foundation for physical rehabilitation. It has a detachable, articulated robotic hand that makes Eco a fully functional prosthetic. This is controlled using myoelectric sensors which read the electrical signals that travel along the wearer's muscles. The middle of the prosthetic houses a processing unit and an engine compatible with Lego Mindstorms, the toy company's robotics line. The outside of the arm has several Lego tubes where Lego parts can be attached, and a tube is also placed at the tip of each finger. This this means not only can the wearer build cool Lego things they can build cool robotic Lego things. The prototype was tested by a little boy named Dario who was able to control a Lego backhoe and led on a spaceship and Lego grippers attached to his arm using the myoelectric sensors. Eco was designed so that children could collaborate and bond over it rather than feel isolated and different because of a prosthetic. There were many problems I was trying to understand the bad perception that kids have around prosthetics, the deep focus that companies have on engineering and not the human part of a kid in disability, the social isolation of a kid because of his condition and how hard can be for them to build a strong self-esteem, Torres said. My idea was not to make a traditional prosthetic but to propose a system that was flexible enough for kids to use, hack and create with by themselves and with their friends.